so reason reasons I love being a stoner as a person um it shaped the music that I listen to uh I've had such a great fucking evening I went to Rotterdam I went to the uh Ahoy um I drove there uh I forgot that I bought a parking ticket um and I drove there and uh, I was there early enough so I had a I had a, a smoke during the day then I ate food and then I went to the concert and then I drove home but I only drove home at like one thirty or so I was good and sober it was a good amount of time in between but I had weed with me that's the point I'm making and um, I've smoked now that I'm home and I don't have any commitments at the moment and uh I, I met uh, Kyle Gass, uh, one half of Tenacious D, after the concert. We waited around. Um, I wanted to like meet like people in the band. And because uh, I was like, I've, I've, I've no train to catch. I have nothing like I'm responsible to get myself home no matter what. I don't have to be anywhere. I, I can stand around. I can do that, you know. I've worked in shops plenty. <laughs> Standing around was part of the job. Um and one of the uh, one of the roadies came over. She gave us uh she was the only female roadie, I think, that was uh that was with uh with tenaciously. Um she gave out uh she she handed us um uh plectrums. We'd waited around for ages. Like I said, we were there until about 1.30. And um, <laughs> yeah, I'd gotten talking. Uh, I was standing on my own for ages and then we kind of crowded around the door like the last of us who were like, who are we going to see? Are we going to get to see anybody? And uh, slowly by slowly, like the members started to come out. And I was like, nobody's like going up to them and asking them for like uh photos or anything and I was like they just played a fucking <laughs> I was like I want to say hi and thanks um it was the lead guitarist's uh birthday birthday uh today I don't know their I don't know his name or not the lead guitarist sorry the drummer um and I don't know their names and it's terrible because they played fucking amazingly uh but the roadie uh um, the roadie is my favorite tenacious D song. If anybody's a tenacious D fan, um, uh, ne yeah, what what's her name? Uh, Dana. She introduced herself to us, uh, but she first like came up and handed us plectrums. Where are they? Kyle Gas. Spicy Midball Tour. They have been my favourite band for 20 years. And I can't believe that I actually hung around and fucking got to meet them. And going back to Kyle Gass, um, I asked him, could I get a photo with him? And he said, just one. So I have one good photo with him. And uh, everybody was talking and I just looked. <laughs> I just looked at him and I was like... <laughs> I was like, are you stoned or are you just really tired? And he was like, what is this, an interview? I was like, no, but like, I have weed if you want weed, like. <laughs> and he was like, yeah, I want weed. <laughs> he was like, where, where is it? I was like, it's in my car. My car is just over there. He was like, bring your car over. <laughs> so I have a photo of, I have a photo of Kyle Gass. <laughs> Smoking weed. With my car as like the background. I don't know what more I could ask for. For a 33rd birthday gift for myself. Mwah. Beautiful. Beautiful. I fucking love that I went there on my own. I love that I wasn't responsible for fucking anything. I love that I could hang around. I love that it, you know, it. nothing mattered. Absolutely nothing mattered. And he was the last person to walk out. And I'm so fucking glad I waited for him. Mwah. Thank you, Kyle Gas. Thank you.